God, this feels good. Fucking collectibles. Gotta pick it up. Note to self. Find a way to control lightning. One turn. <laughs> Running out of juice. Lost count on these things. We're standing in a parking garage. I don't like it either, but been giving us many options. I can't believe they tried to force us out. I can't believe you forgot the mimosas. I think we have bigger problems. I don't think you realize how much I love mimosas. I can't... I can't help but notice that people are trying to kill them. Yeah, they're really big on that here. What did you do? Is now really a good time? We can wait until we're done shooting people. Well, I'm great at multitasking. Remember when we offered you a deal on that airplane and you responded by killing everyone? Yeah. It's like that, but worse. Never should have loved with me. Oh, Yeah! 
Hey, Viola. Thought you should know that Kinsey misses you. Really? That's so sweet. Who's Kinsey? You remember Kinsey. She was that hacker that Matt Miller hated. Isn't she crazy? You know, she really grows on you. The halo's not working. Two? Let's get you two back to Bane. Hooray! After being reunited in Hell, Kiki and Viola wasted no time in doing what they do best. Facilitate the running of businesses. However, the De Winter sister's success did not sit well with other would-be power players in Hell. The sisters' operations all came under attack at once, forcing them on the run. Soon, the twins found themselves on the receiving end of an offer they couldn't refuse. After all, it was better to own one-fifth of something than to be dead. You helped us. Now let us help you. Here's a little something made popular by another group of sisters, the Gorgons. Dane's letting us use his Ultor training room to test out your Stone Blast power. So go ahead and blast these demons to turn them to stone. After they're petrified, you can use your pistol to shatter them. Ah, life is good. Thanks, me. Nice! 
Stone Blast is especially useful on flying demons like this one. All right, now let's see you drop a few more. A blast will also take down the shield of a dark insider, leaving it vulnerable to gunfire. Take this dark- I think you've got the gist of it. All right, let's go. Mind if I do? We called in some favors and found the president. They've been trapped inside some sort of soul crystal inside Satan's palace. The only way you're gonna save them is by drawing Satan out, so keep doing what you're doing. This is bad. <laughs> Abandoned ship! We've been boarded! <laughs> <laughs> Things off my ship. Scourge of the Seven Seas. Getting the hang of this murder thing. <laughs> Got a bit of treasure in that chest over there. The weapon you find inside may help with our little imp problem. That is a freakishly large hammer. Okay, maybe I do like murder. A little. Summon these imps to serve as my crew. I forgot what a handful they could be. Once aboard, they wouldn't listen to their cup. 
They run amok in the bowels of the ship. Queen Anne's Revenge! Isn't that just a fancy name for a boat? Names are important, my dear. You can't build a legacy without a name. Zinyak's destruction of Earth had a profound impact on the afterlife. To heaven, it was a logistical nightmare. Saint Peter's meticulous nature drove purgatory wait times to unbearable levels. Meanwhile, in hell, where souls in pain were used as currency, it created a new era of prosperity for the wickedly enterprising. This economic boom resulted in the coffers of hell to be overflowing, which in turn piqued the interest of the most notorious man that sailed the Seven Seas. Long had Blackbeard been a thorn in Satan's side, robbing tax collectors on a semi-regular basis. But the promise of an immeasurable fortune drove him to be even bolder. An arrangement was reached. Blackbeard would provide information on strategic targets in exchange for a share of the profit. Johnny, who was interested in murder, not money, happily agreed. I grant ye the ability to summon my crew whenever they're needed. Matey, it's time for your lesson. Let's summon me favorite scurvy riddled hellion, the imp. Why don't you start off by summoning an imp to take out those enemies? <laughs> there you go, matey. Now take down the other demon. <laughs> those little ankle biters are vicious. Now let's practice your aim. Take down the demons on the islands. Few things are as rewarding as pressing someone into service, am I right? Now get going. There's a whole wide world waiting to be plundered. <laughs> 